इंदिरा कॉलोनी रांची झारखंड ऑन द मार्जिन ऑफ द रांची सिटी अ नॉन डिस्क्रिप्ट कॉलोनी होम टू नियरली टू हंड्रेड लेप्रेसी अफेक्टेड पीपल एंड देर फैमिलीज from the surface everything appears normal here but not many people know that these people have a stigmatized past that still scars their memories jab hum 8 saal ka the tabhi unko bimari pakda tha 8 saal ke umar se hi bimari pakda to meri maa ilaaj ilaaj karti thi temporary doctor se koi pehchan nahi paya ki kusht rog hai uske baad mein ek doctor bataya ki nahi isko kusht rog pakda liya ye bachchi ko तो घर में पता चल गया सबको मेरे पापा को और मेरे भाई भुजाई थे सब तो वो लोग घिन्ना से मतलब बोलते थे कि बच्चा को गोदी मत लो ऐसे तुम अलग सुतो हम लोग को साबुन को छुओ मत ऐसे करके व्यवहार घिन्ना टाइप का बढ़ने लग गया घर में तो एक दिन मेरा पापा क्या किया मतलब अपना जो घर के लोग थे मेम्बर सबको बुलाए कि इसको क्या किया जाएगा तो बैठे जैसे बैठकी होता है उस टाइप घर में हमको ये पता नहीं था कि हमको घर से निकला देंगे हम लोग थ्रोन आउट ऑफ होम मुन्नी देवी मूव्ड फ्रॉम प्लेस टू प्लेस फाइनली रीचिंग द विलेज वे नो वन डिस्क्रिमिनेटेड हर बिकॉज एवरी वन शेयर हर एग्नी इन सम वे और दी अदर सिंस टू थाउजेंड एट एन एल आर फाउंडेशन हैज बिन वर्किंग इन द कॉलोनी to empower these people to take charge of their life leprosy is caused by a bacteria it affects nerves skin and eyes contrary to popular belief it is treatable one week after taking the medicine people become non contagious 95% of the population is naturally immune to the bacteria nor does the infection affect the children of leprosy affected people who live happily with their disabled parents but once disabled these people face a unique predicament for the entire life as the bacteria attacks the nerves it destroys the ability to feel pain and injury these people are prone to injury from a routine activity like walking or doing household chores these injuries can lead to formation of ulcers if not attended in time This is called secondary disability. If not treated on time, it can result in shortening of fingers and toes, sometimes leading to limb loss in the future. 8 years ago, NLR Foundation started its self-care program in the colony. Its aim was to stop occurrences of secondary disability among the already disabled due to leprosy. डर चुने हम लोग को इन्होंने समझाए और हम लोग यहाँ का बस्ती के लोग को समझाए बहुत कोई नहीं आते थे पहले लेकिन अब तो पराया सब कोई आने लग गए सेल्फ केयर बिगिन्स एज अ कम्युनल एक्सरसाइज इट इन्वॉल्व सोकिंग देर फीट इन वॉटर फॉर हाफ एन आवर scrubbing it to remove dead skin and applying oil to keep the skin soft as they clean their limbs they also become aware of any prick or injury
In most instances, rest is what they need for an ulcer to heal. Some wounds are dressed up to keep the dust and flies away. They are supposed to do self-care at home every day. But it takes two years of constant monitoring before self-care becomes part of their routine. The sea change comes when they see their ulcers healing up. They become confident in taking care of their own body. Education support. मैं बीए पार्ट वन में पढ़ती हूँ और आर्ट्स लेके सोशियोलॉजी आना है। चार्टर अकाउंटेंसी का कोर्स कर रहा हूँ जी पांची से। मेरी मम्मी तो कुछ बताती नहीं है घर के बारे में उतना लेकिन यहाँ जो जो हुआ है बोलती है कि बहुत हम दुख झेले हैं तुम लोग कितना बड़ा किए हैं तुम लोग अच्छा से पढ़ो लिखो। Children of leprosy affected people are the most vulnerable part of their society. Due to low social acceptance and meager income of their parents, the dropout rate of these children from education was very high. A similar prospect loomed large for Nirmal and Sunaina as well. There was a child who was studying in the government school. He was studying in the government school. He was studying in the school. उसके बाद छूट जाता था, पैसा आगे नहीं मिलता था, तो फिर हाई रेजिक्शन नहीं हो पाता था। हम लोग जब छोटे-छोटे थे, हम लोग से जो बड़े थे, वो एट के बाद रेजिक्शन कर छोड़ने के बाद, वो लोग कचरा चुनने जाते थे, कचरा बीनते थे। It was the year 2010. During the self-care program, staff of NLR would come to the colony very often. Many parents would approach them to seek support of their children's education. The same year, NLR started an education support program for children. यहाँ पर सबको निदर्लन वाले स्कूल ड्रेस, फिर जूता, सब चीज जितना खर्चा होता है, वो सब देते हैं, बुक, कॉपी, मतलब जरूरत सामान सब चीज देते हैं। पहले कोई टेन तक ही पढ़ा था, कोई मेट एट तक ही पढ़ा था। हम लोग अब चीज पढ़ रहे हैं, हम लोग कम से कम लगभग सभी बच्चे ग्रेजुएशन हो गए हैं। NLR's commitment was unique to support children's education till they want to study. And beyond that, getting them employable skills as well. Nirmal and Sunaina both benefited from this program as well. I'm actually science like a panna charate, like in घर की आर्थिक स्थिति ठीक नहीं थी उस टाइम नीदरलैंड वाले भी नहीं आए थे तो और उस टाइम भैया शुरू शुरू जॉब कर रहे थे तो इतना पैसा भी नहीं था तो वो भैया बोले कि अभी हम इसमें नहीं दे सकते हैं उसमें तो हर एजुकेशन में फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री मैथ्स आपके लिए पैसे चाहिए तो वो कहे कि कॉमर्स का काम मिलेगा कॉमर्स में पढ़ा था तो कॉमर्स में पढ़ते गए ग्रेजुएशन किए उसके बाद एक आर्टिकल्स आया उसमें हम पढ़े सी ऐसे ऐसे बनते हैं तो फिर भैया भी बोले NLR connected its education initiative to self-care to find leprosy-affected people who are economically challenged and live in unserved areas. 
Today, education support has become the most engaging initiative of NLR. To help these children get education to build their career. In the last five years, NLR has supported over 1900 children through this program. Livelihood support through skill development. Livelihood support is another program reaching the leprosy affected unserved families. Kindali Devi, a disabled due to leprosy. Without much support from her husband, she struggled alone to raise her two sons. Realizing the challenging circumstances of the family, NLR offered education support to her younger son and livelihood training for her elder son. He was sent for a diesel engine mechanic training program at a reputed institute. After the course, he gained employment with a global earth-moving giant. A timely intervention eventually improved the quality and dignity of their life, providing them a standing in their society. Livelihood support through microfinance. NLR aims to rehabilitate leprosy affected people in their own society. It encourages entrepreneurship among them. Vijay did not have any risk-taking capacity earlier. He would buy stuff from the local market and then try to sell it the same day. NLR realized that this way Vijay would not be able to sustain for long. On one hand, it started education support for his children and on the other, it encouraged him to expand his business. It provided him with an interest-free loan. With the money, Vijay got a cart made. He stocked raw material and took help of the family members to prepare things at home. Slowly, his sale and profit began to increase. After leaving home, Sarfaraz did many odd jobs. Later, he got some tools from his father and began woodwork again, though at a very small scale. 
In the meantime, he joined a self-care camp in a nearby primary health center. Self-care helped him a lot. I don't know how much I can do it. I can see that it's clean and clean. Now the mobile is going to be taken away. This is the same thing. हाथ भी ना धोए चल गए कुछ वो आ गया फोन चल गए कुछ सामान ला गए फायदा मिलता है जख्म नहीं हो देता सबसे बड़ा बात ये और जख्म हो जाएगा तो कोई काम नहीं एन एल आर हैड ऑलरेडी सेंस्ड हिज एंटरप्राइजिंग स्पिरिट इट प्रपोज अ फाइनेंस सपोर्ट फॉर हिम दोस्ती हुई बातचीत होते हुए पूछे हमसे कि क्या काम करते हैं बोले कि बड़ी मिस्त्री का हम काम करते हैं तो कहाँ पर करते हैं तो घर में फिर घर आए दो तीन बार मुझे बात होने के बाद घर आए फिर बोले ही हमको कि ऐसा करो अगर कहीं से मदद मिलेगा तो काम करोगे फिर बहुत सोचते समझते तब फिर बोले कि ऐसा ठीक है दे दी हम एक लाख रुपये का डिमांड किए एक लाख रुपया मैं उन्होंने लेना था तो पचास हज़ार रुपया बोले फिर हज़ार भी दिए तो अड़सठ हज़ार रुपया कुल मिला के हमको दिए With the money, he expanded his business. He bought a new set of tools and also opened a workshop on the highway, increasing his reach to the market. His confidence in NLR has grown steadily. He travels to various places to encourage those disabled due to leprosy to be on their feet. <laughs> अब बहुत जगह ले भी जाते हैं हमको बहुत जगह ले भी जाते हैं डॉक्टर साहब और जहाँ जाके भी देखें कि सबका हक में बढ़िया बात बोलते हैं विद इट्स लॉन्ग एक्सपीरियंस इन द फील्ड एन एल आर फाउंडेशन हैज बिन एबल टू इवॉल्व अ सक्सेसफुल कम्युनिटी बेस्ड इंक्लूसिव डेवलपमेंट मॉडल Despite its strong intent, its resources are limited. Even in areas where it is working, over 43,000 persons are still in need of self-care trainings to prevent disability from rising further. Up till now, it has reached only 5,000 people. Over 16,000 children still require education support. Up till now, it has been able to reach only 1,900 children. Several hundreds of youngsters are in need of skill development to get employment. NLR believes that the battle needs to be fought collaboratively. Let us fight leprosy together.